up guys? Riding around a little bit. Nobody come rob me. Kind of bummed. So this is Paperville Road and uh, way back when, back on my 225, I used to have a little video playlist series, it's still up, but uh, I, I called it I called it Paperville Trails Trilogy. And uh, this is pretty much the main place I used to ride off-road. And uh, yeah, so up here there's a whole bunch of trails and stuff that I used to ride at. And I haven't ridden that in a long time. And I think there's new owners of it. Oh, that was fifth gear. I think they don't like people riding on it anymore. Taking those turns, but uh, yeah, I'm not sure. I think the last time I was over here, there were some posted signs up, but I rode here anyway. Nobody said anything, so uh, I'm gonna go check it out. I'm not in dirt gear or anything. I got vans on and some blue jeans, so. I don't know, I'm just going to check it out a little bit, see what I see. Haven't been back here in a long time. It's uh, rained the past few days, so it's probably really, really bad. I was kind of scared to go up that thing. I haven't been up it in so long. Here they are, guys. I haven't been off-road in a long time. Let's see what we see. But uh, yeah guys, I got like a 50-50 dual sport tire on the back of this thing, so bear with me. It's pretty wet out. Woo, slipping and sliding everywhere. Whoa. Uh, uh, oh man. Gee, that is slippery. Whoa. That's dangerous. It's like a spring from a mattress. Super rusty. Let's see if we can turn around here. Oh, uh, my off-road abilities have gone down. If you haven't noticed, it's been a while. Whoa! Oh my gosh! Jeez, I'm already super tired. Man, I never used to. I used to fly through these trails, man. I used to know them so well. It's been a long time since I've been out here. Ooh, this is all wet. There's a big old mud hole right here. I remember that. Had my Jeep through there before. <laughs> the only jump in the whole trail. Yeah, I might come back whenever it's a little more dry. I used to ride dirt all the time. Those of you that have been around with me since before I got my uh, 450, I used to ride dirt like all the time. Like probably as much, if not more, than when I road on road i mean like videos wise not like actually riding time you know i was back in my little 225 though it was a little more manageable on the trails this thing's kind of a hoss i'm not a very big guy about 510 511 like buck 50 buck 45 not very heavy like you guys know if you don't know a lot of, a lot of people call me a stick that's why my name's shred stick so yeah i'm pretty skinny here's some power lines kind of cool well, look at that road over there. I don't even know if you guys can see that. There's a trail that goes down in there, back down in the creek bed. Yeah, if y'all want to see me go off road a little bit, I'll put the link to the Paperville Trails trilogy down in the description for you guys to check out. And I, I, I mean, I wasn't the best off road rider, but I mean, I had, a, I had fun. I could make it up almost every hill climb here. There's only one I couldn't make it up, and it was huge. Uh, my, my friend Mike made it up at once. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, when I first bought this thing, it had like a worn out trials tire in the back. So it wasn't even that good off road. I 
I used to rip these trails, dude, like faster than that. But yeah, I really need some freaking sumo wheels so I can put straight knobbies on these on these on these wheels and uh, have some good traction. Right now, it's dual sport tires. is isn't cutting it. So straight, whoa, cross running, get out of there. But uh, yeah, I mean, it's a straight 50-50 tire. Just not really doing it for me. I had to do some arm workouts, bro. My arm pump is like embarrassing. I'm like a little weakling out here. They don't call me stick for nothing, you know? But that trail up there at the top where those telephone wires are, they lead down into here into this creek bed. And yeah, it's a pretty good riding out through here. Pretty, it gets pretty muddy though down the creek bed. See those little kids up there? <laughs> they were loving it. These little roosters. Knee knocker. 